Keeping your 8-BitDo adapter firmware updated is essential for optimal performance and compatibility. Understanding why and when to update will help you get the most out of your gaming setup. Firmware updates serve three critical purposes. First, they ensure compatibility with new gaming consoles like the Nintendo Switch 2. Second, updates add support for new 8-BitDo controllers, such as the Ultimate 2C and Ultimate 2.4G wireless controllers, expanding your gaming options. Third, updates fix bugs like button misalignment, controller disconnection issues, and optimize joystick dead zones for better gaming performance. Now let's look at when you should update your adapter firmware. You should update your adapter in several situations. First, whenever you purchase new controllers to ensure they work properly with your existing setup. Second, when you get a new gaming console, updates ensure your adapter maintains compatibility with the new system. Third, if you experience any performance issues like controller disconnections or button problems, an update often resolves these issues. Finally, stay current with new firmware releases to access the latest features and improvements. As of July 2025, the latest firmware for the USB Adapter 2 is version 2.07. Regular updates ensure you have access to the newest features and compatibility improvements. Understanding why and when to update your 8-BitDo adapter ensures optimal gaming performance and compatibility across all your devices. To update your 8-BitDo adapter firmware, you'll need a few basic requirements. First, ensure you have a computer running Windows or Mac OS and a USB cable to connect your adapter. Next, download and install the 8-BitDo Ultimate Software version 2 from the official 8-BitDo website. This is the primary tool for updating and customizing your 8-BitDo devices. Connect your 8-BitDo adapter to your computer using a USB cable. The adapter should be recognized by your system automatically. Launch the Ultimate software and follow the on-screen instructions. The software will detect your adapter and guide you through the firmware update process. This typically takes just a few minutes. If you're using the adapter with a Nintendo Switch, you need to enable Pro Controller Wired Communication in your Switch system settings. Navigate to System Settings, then Controllers and Sensors, and turn on this option. Finally, test your adapter with your controllers to ensure everything is working correctly. Try connecting different controllers and verify that all buttons and features function as expected.